What's up guys, it's your boy Tomichi here today and we're back once again for another tutorial. And today's tutorial is gonna be three moves focused around balance of cutting shapes. Now before we get into the video, I just wanna say a quick thing. Yes, if I sound like I have a stuffy nose and I'm sick, it's because I am, so let's get into it. Okay, so the first move is called the eight step. Now basically what it's gonna look like from your guys' point of view is this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight simple steps and from your point of view, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so basically what you're gonna do first is you're gonna throw your foot forward and you're gonna go one, two, okay? Simple like that, you're gonna go one, two, and you're gonna go back into neutral where you began. So it's gonna be one, two, three, four. Simple, right? And then you're gonna be going this way. Now the best thing to do is when you go one, two, three, four, don't be facing this way. Try to angle yourself because you're gonna be going this way or this way if you prefer. So you're gonna be going one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's the exact same move, but what it's made for is when you're cutting shapes, you can throw it in like this and get back into your shapes again. See what I mean? It's a good filler move. So that's the first one. I recommend trying it for a bit, but it's not too difficult. Just remember it's one, two, three, four, and then four the other way. All right, let's get into the next video. Okay, so the second move is called the double kick. And what the double kick looks like is that, okay? You're gonna go one, two, three. Now three obviously isn't a kick, it's two kicks. So what this move, basically this is mainly about balance. As you can see, it's really hard because what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna be kicking and shifting your way back. And then when you kick over here, you're gonna be shifting your way forward. Now it's gonna be really hard to show you guys slowly. What you're gonna be doing is you're gonna be kicking your foot like that. You're gonna rotate your foot back to here and bring your foot back down. Now, where the element comes of rotating is from this foot. So if you watch this foot, you're gonna be kicking and rotating like that. So you're gonna be on your toes, on this foot or this foot, whichever side you wanna do, you know, your spin on or whatever, okay? So what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna be cutting the shapes away, you're gonna kick your right foot out, you're gonna swivel and put it back down, okay? Now, it is really hard to get this move, you know, in a few tries. You're gonna to have to take a while to do it, but basically you're cutting the shapes, you're gonna kick, turn and back down. Now, even, of course, look, I, I can't even, you know, land back around, okay, maybe I just did. But either way, it takes a while to practice. So if you don't get this move, keep practicing it, but I guarantee when you get it, it will look good and you'll feel great. All right, let's move on to the last move. Okay, the last move is called the one foot shuffle. Now the one foot shuffle, yes, you will fall off balance, but the key for this move is how long you can stay on balance for. So what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna be cutting away, you know, doing your shapes, but you're gonna need a lot of momentum for this. So you're gonna need to kind of throw forward. So while you're cutting shapes, you're gonna do this as long as you can till you know you touch back on the ground again now of course if you lean your foot back you can make things easier some people have seen it doing with their foot forward and then get into some other kind of crazy move so what you're going to do is you're going to be going basically slow down exaggerated you're going to be going from your heel to your toe from your heel to your toe like that okay so cutting away shapes you're going to go heel toe heel toe heel toe okay now to practice it first, if you want to just kind of, you know, just, just do that to, you know, see how you can do with it. If you want to go really slowly like that, it's a lot easier. But when you're cutting shapes fast and then you kind of do that back into your shapes, it would look really good. So give that move a try. That one is a bit more difficult. No, you will not stay on your foot for a very long time. If anybody can, fair play to them, but it takes a lot of practice. Okay. That's the news for today. That's it for today, guys. Hope you liked the tutorial. Make sure you give this video a big like if you did enjoy it. Also, knock on those post notifications as we will have a lot of new videos coming out. I guarantee you guys are gonna like it. If you wanna check out our first cutting shape tutorial, make sure you click here. It's pretty good. It should help you out. If you wanna check out our dope dancing side, the more freestyle side of things, check this video out right here. Until the next video, guys, as always, stay strong, keep dancing.